Ed Cassano is 63 years old. Retired from his career as an air conditioning engineer and divorced from his wife, Ed lives alone in Claremont, Florida. Today, he shares his home with over 40 venomous snakes. Ed's fascination with snakes started in early childhood. At eight years old, he was taken to a reptile show where he had his first experience holding a snake. The skin was smooth and shiny and uh, muscular, and it just seemed to be a fascinating animal at that time. And uh, that was the start of my snake keeping. Ed's interest in reptiles was supported by his mother, who allowed him to keep several non-venomous snakes at home. Even after all these years, every time I go into a venomous snake cage, there's always a little adrenaline boost. You're just inches away from death at that point, so you're dealing with something that, uh, you know, is dangerous on a daily basis. To me, it's, it's very, very exciting and challenging and satisfying to try and establish a mutual trust with these animals, not through force, uh, or anything like that, but just where you can go ahead and be accepted by the animal. Well, see, this particular python, I don't feel like I'm in danger at all. He, once I get past that stage uh, where he uh, recognizes me as me and not food, uh, I've got complete faith in this snake. You know, a snake like this could overpower almost any human being if he, if he wanted to. But we deal with that all the time anyway. People have Dobermans, Shepherds, I mean dogs that potentially could kill their owners also. Uh, but we accept that. And uh, you know, I'll come to accept him as he is.